Hey everyone, we're back with a new episode of Everdives. I'm Mike Staub and... And I'm Brendan Bailey. And uh, we have... We don't know what we're playing yet, because for those of you who are unaware about what this show is, we have a Sega Genesis Everdrive that has been... Uh, we're playing it through a, an analog Mega SG. Hook that up to a nice big HDMI TV. And uh, the Genesis Everdrive has a great function on it called Start Random Game. And we're just going to take an Everdive into the Everdrive and see what type of random crazy stuff it comes up with. Because uh, we've had some doozies uh, and some really bad games. And we all know that you all out there love bad games. And some good games. I mean, let's be fair. Lotus was good. It was all right. Yeah. Now, we've got all sorts of things on here. We have prototype games, beta versions of games, all the Japanese and European games. Yeah. Uh, all the Master System games. So... There's a good chance that you might see something wacky. We don't know what we're going to get. It's random. And then we so. do three, two, one, Everdive. Everdive. Up. Oh. oh. Okay. We're off to oh. a good start. Soldados do Tempo. Time Soldiers. Time Soldiers. Well. And here we go. What is that? I don't know. Looks okay. like some sort of alien robot. There's the story. Oh, oh no! Oh all no! All the time soldiers. Vaporized. Something in Spanish. More stuff in Spanish. It's important lore to the story here. So this is a top-down. All right, it's uh, it's, it's it's commando. Pretty much. Watch out for the cavemen. They're coming at you. Oh man, is that like better gun? The caveman just dropped a rocket launcher. I don't know why he was throwing. Oh. Scatter shot! Oh, look, and I'm running out. I ran out of ammo for that, though. Oh, that was short lived. No, 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 no. You have ammo. Oh, look at that. Don't let the. Pro oh, that, that crocodile just walked right over that rock there. Yeah, yeah, it's pretty good. Oh, he just dropped. Ah! No! Oh, oh, you exploded. What? Oh. Oh. Do I have lives? Look at that big bomb. You arbitrarily placed health bar up top. Is that a, no? I, is that a health bar? Or is that me using the the energy? Oh, maybe. Or maybe you drain your health to do things. Like everyone loves that. That that's everyone's favorite thing in video games. When like your special oh, attacks like your, drain your energy. Like your special attacks. Yeah, that everyone. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. whoa. Watch out for the, the the flaming marbles flying at you. I know. Flaming globes of Sigmund. Oh. Oh. Direct hit. I think I'm dead. Game over. No. Right, what was the name going. of this game? Uh, Time Soldiers. Time Soldiers. Something in Spanish followed by Time Soldiers. Yeah. I just want to get to like a boss or something. Oh, there you go. Oh. Triceratops. <laughs> 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 I don't know what I'm doing. I don't even know if I'm hitting this guy. Shoot him in the horn. I, I Shoot the horn. The other horn. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's that. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I don't. I think lives are arbitrary. I don't think you have. I don't think I have lives. Because I keep dying and it doesn't do anything. But I'm also continuous. Oh, oh you got him. Hey. Oh. And then there's a thing. All right. Pass a gem. Where am I going now? Oh, I see. It's time soldiers. Time so we soldiers. started in prehistoric. Now I'm in Rome. Now we're here we go. It's Rome. Rome. There's, there's ghosts. This is, I guess, what they thought Rome looked like. I guess because the Romans killed a lot of people, so there's ghosts. I don't, I don't, I don't know, know, man. I don't know. But I think I just got uh, rockets. Or oh, those arrows. I think those are arrows. Because the Romans would have used arrows. Oh, I think I finally died. Either way, you have technology that didn't exist in the, uh, the time period. No, I don't. And I'm done with this game. No. So that was Time Soldiers. Time Soldiers? Yeah. All right. So. Well, it's up for you, Brendan. Here you go. If you thought that game looked good, go check out Time Soldiers for Sega. I couldn't tell if that was a Master System game. I or think that was a Genesis game. Probably a Mega Drive game. Like a bad... Yeah, like a bad Genesis game. Okay. Uh, okay, three, two, one. Ever dive. 
dead wrong. Oh, whoa, I was, I was wrong. Just took a long time to load. Game from the edge. Strike! Let's go! Let's do this! Nineties helicopter action! Yes. Give me that Apache. I feel like 2001. That was uh, 20, 22 years ago. Yeah, this actually happened. Friends, it is time to take back America. Oh, this, boy. This did, did happen. <laughs> With our volunteer, angel patrols will rid the streets of... I didn't read it fast enough. Together, we will channel our energies into showing the so-called leaders how America ought to be run. Malone, Malone, Malone. Four more years. Four more years. <laughs> so he's literally W. Bush going to war for the war on terror in 2001. Great show tonight, Mr. Malone. You sent for me? We're running into some static at the Hawaii station, so I want you to check it out via Apache helicopter. <laughs> what seems to be the problem? Forces team has discovered our plan. I'm sending in Solid Snake. I suspect <laughs> someone in our organization is broadcasting information to the Strike Core. A core is C what do you need me to do? C O R E. By they the way, they have the same voice. By the way, yeah. I want you to fly to Hawaii and oversee the operation. We must deal with this Strike Force, or our plans for soon or for the super weapon may fail. I'll handle it. I know how these guys operate. The core. So I. Geo or Ego. We read you, Ego. I've infiltrated Malone's lair, but I think he's on to me. <laughs> That's too funny. He said something about a, uh, a limousine and his son. It was too obvious. <laughs> he's going to Hawaii in a helicopter. <laughs> How long does it take to fly to Hawaii in a I helicopter? Think you can take out a skyscraper in a single blast, and this takes place in 2001? Wow. I don't That's know, man. Brutal. Powered by a huge. I've got to go. I'll tell you the rest from the limo. Ego out. The limo. Oh man, here, here we, we go. go. Building seven. Uh oh. The limo was a bomb. Agent Ego is dead. There's our lead story on tonight's news. Crime bosses has assassinate son of crusading media leader. The real story is the switch channel. Switch? Get Whoa! Oh, cancel culture. This game is predicting the future. I know, I know. Meanwhile, in Hawaii. Hello. I'll fly the helicopter. Commander. It looks like your vacation is going to be cut short. I knew I shouldn't have bought this phone. He's got a cell phone? He's got a smartphone. Our friend H.R. Malone is up to his old tricks again. So what's the plan? Luckily for you, the disturbance is right there in Hawaii. Oh, wow. That's Meet convenient. Our mobile command post. That's sign. convenient. How do you say that? Ahu? Oahu? 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 Aloha. Group drinks away. Start. I think you have to just hit A. Press start to play. I think you just gotta hit A. Oh my gosh, there's too much story. Welcome back, Commander. This is our target. Okay, I'm skipping this. Alright, let's go. Oh, going the wrong way. And it was all building up to this. Kind of lackluster helicopter game. We've all played the strike games. I have all three of them. They're all basically the same. You get in the helicopter, you shoot stuff. Stuff shoots at you, you gotta try not to get shot down, just blow up everything. I don't even know what you need to hit. In that radio tower? Got it! Nice, that explosion art is really good. They're not, they're not, they're not bad games. My major gripe with these games is that there's just no music. I feel weird. Like yeah, yeah, have, why, why is there not? This game needs to have, like, the, like, the rockin', like, Genesis guitar. Like, give me, like, <laughs> give me, like, the... Just, just, just take the Thunder Force 4 music and just slap it on there, and we'll be good. That's what you should do. That should be like one of your ROM projects. Just, you just put the Thunder Force 4. We can just layer it in into the video. Yeah, I could do that if you want. All right, got to kill the truck. Get that Yeah, truck. you don't know. That truck might have files. Oh, yeah, you, you know what happens shoot. with files. You can shoot missiles to kill stuff faster, I guess. Oh, nice. You don't want to wait for the little... Do you even know how many missiles you got? You have to push start to see... Uh... Push start continue? Okay, so... Where are you going? I 
guess uh, I guess I have to go towards the white cloth there. Whoa, uh -oh. stealth boat! Cut them down. Is that a James Bond movie that had the stealth boat in it? Yeah, it was Goldeneye and Goldeneye. Is it Goldeneye? Yeah. Goldeneye have a stealth boat? Or is that, uh. Is that The World Is Not Enough? I don't know. Or was it Tomorrow Never Dies? All the Pierce Brosnan ones kind of blurred into one yeah. movie for me. I don't even know what yeah. happened to each one. Everyone, people only there like was Goldeneye. A, there was an ice castle in one of them. Yeah. People only like Goldeneye because. John Cleese movie. showed up at one point. He's R. Yeah. John Cleese plays R. Nah, you're gonna die. Alright, I'm gonna just get away from this. I have no idea where I am. I don't know where you I are. I assume one of the things on the map is me. Yeah, I don't know. Are you the thing that's like pulsating? Maybe I was looking at the wrong one. Baby. Okay, closing on target. <sighs> nice. Shoot it down. Here of airship report. <laughs> <laughs> Acknowledged. Helium mix optimal. <laughs> Bombardiers <laughs> to your stations. <laughs> <laughs> Is that red alert? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh! oh! I won't make it. No. <laughs> oh, he's back. Right here. At least they here. were re able to rebuild the helicopter Regular that quickly. Tweed fans out there. All right. This, I like this game is just checking the map to figure out when you're over the thing that you need to actually shoot. All right, it's this building. Oh, wasn't I? Wasn't I? Shooting You're blowing up. Maybe not. Hey, look! I could have sworn I destroyed that building earlier. Woo! Maybe there were two. And you I won. The first one. You finished. You beat it. You beat I the one. You beat the game. Everyone else is a loser. Mm -hmm. Oh, now there's more. Oh no. All right. So you shoot stuff. Oh, I'm, am I out of ammunition? I don't know. Oh well, now this game's basically ruined. Just crash in. Can you crash into the building and die? Let them kill you. I'll hit the car. Yeah, you know, destroy that museum. Nobody needs to learn about the history. Uh, that was one of my targets. Oh, we know it wasn't. Whoopsie daisy. <laughs> take, those, take that, Monticello. Those, <laughs> those poor children. <laughs> They'll never learn about whatever this is. What's in you? I think it's in the truck. Uh, supplies. Yeah. You know, for the, uh, for the army. Oh, look, there's another observatory. Oh, I'm out of missiles. I, all right, I cannot shoot anymore, you and, I'm, fuel. and I'm running out of fuel. This game, this is the kind of game where it's like, just give me infinite ammo. Yeah. Like, make it a shooter. What am I supposed to do? I gotta find like, I gotta find like, and I'm gonna crash soon because I have no fuel. Can I pick this up? I don't think so. Oh wait, I think you can land. Oh, there we go. Get the hook. Oh my god, this is painful. All right, what did I get? Apparently. <laughs> He bounced into the building and spun around. I, I don't even know what I picked up. I just picked something up, but I still have zero ammo of all my ammo types. I think it's time to quit. All right. We've well, had an urban strike. <laughs> I crashed. Ran out Give of me fuel. this. If you ever try to pilot an Apache helicopter, you know, bring infinite ammo. Yeah, make sure bring you got infinite fuel. It's not worth yeah, it. Make sure you got that solid snake headband. All right. The story was pretty good, though. Oh, yeah. I yeah. like the part with the limousine. Yeah, me too. This one has been probably our be our best ever drive ever dive we've done. I wouldn't go that far. Second best. We did play that uh, that NHL game. That oh, that, 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 that was, was pretty, pretty good. good. All right, three, two, one, ever dive. Give me something good. Oh, you gotta play RoboCop three. Oh wait, no, but you got bear. You got. Oh man, this is a, this is like a a four and one. Uh, it's a four and it's one. It's a pirate cart. I mean, this is kind of cheating. You get you get your choice of four great games. Yeah. Oh, do they not work? <laughs> Sorry, so Sunset Riders doesn't work. None of them work. <laughs> Lovely. <laughs> we had we had a shot. We were so close. We were so close. So close to playing something halfway decent. Well, three to one, ever done. All right. file let's go <laughs> it's done it stopped i think that's it it has stopped to working we're we're really hit really hitting a, oh, a lot of good stuff man <sighs> ever dive just the good old okay oh oh okay. namco burning force no 
No. Nope. Uh, some sort of uh, some sort of baseball. Some sort of baseball simulation. I hate when you can't hit up and down. I'm gonna be the Hornets. Why not? Oh, okay. All right, it's Namco Go ESPN Kokara. Sports Center. Uh, Tonight on Namco Sports Center, baseball simulation ben -in -in, ben -in -in. with some cute sprites. It's very, uh, it's very fantasy-like music. I know, it's weird. It's like, play ball. Here's the pitch. Drag one. All right, they look like almost like South Park characters. Du, 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 du. I'm out. Well, let, let me did we we tried. I'll, I'll do one inning of this game. Oh come on! Oh, oh come Texas on! Texas Leaguer, Texas Leaguer. Hey! Fair ball, go. fair ball. Go to second. Oh, he's trying to he's trying to make it a double. Safe. Very nice. Uh, see, all see. right, you gonna advance the runner. I advance the runner. I got two outs. All right. Four hitter. So this, this should be their big guy. Let's get a single. Oh, that's a don't, foul ball. If I strike out here, I'm going to look like a fool. Don't try to murder it, kid. Ah! How do you strike out with a guy on third? Ugh. Change. All right, now you got to pitch. I like the little voice samples. Oh, that was right down the... Down the shortstop, really. Really earning his really, pay on really, that really, play there. Really, really not earning that $30 million. That's right, baby. Oh, he's still second. Oh, man. Popped it up. Oh, another Texas leaguer. I feel like there's going to be a lot of those in this game. Oh, yeah, absolutely. The ultimate conundrum with baseball games is when there's a, a Texas leaguer. It's like, do you push up so that your infielders go, you know, run to get it? Or do you push down so that your outfielders come down to get it? Oh, I'm so close in the dive! Whichever one you pick, you're, you're screwed. Wrong. You're screwed. You, ne you never pick the right one. Well. The only good video baseball game I've ever played is Baseball Stars <laughs> 2. Oh, dead ball. I hit him. I pegged him on purpose. Yeah, we got to play some Baseball Stars 2 for Neo Geo. Oh, that's a good one. Uh, that's the best baseball game. Almost like game Neo Turf game. Masters. Well, that is, that's also the best golf game. Exactly. Well. I mean, listen. The Neo Geo has the best sports games. I don't think there's any debate. You're out of there. Oh, man. All right. I'm done with every, whatever baseball game you know, this is. He's beating you by 20 runs. 30 runs. Here. You you go. Well. We've had no luck. That was fun. Da, 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 da. <sighs> 3 2 1 average. Overdrive. If you get something good. Oh. Oh, it's a, it's another Chinese game. They have a track record. Yeah. Doing pretty good. Box birthday, 2004. A little bit late. Well. <laughs> Happy birthday, Box. <laughs> That's uh, also known as something in Chinese Mandarin. Oh! oh! <laughs> it's the Genesis port of Shenmue 3. Oh, please. The please. Classic. Please. Also known as. <laughs> oh, it's. The, uh, excuse me. It's not the Genesis port. This is the Sega Master System port. This is not a this real is controller. This is not a real scroller. Also what? known as... What is this? Copyright <laughs> violation, episode three, The Rise of the Arrows. <laughs> it's, just, it's just this nonsense? Because this is what keeps happening. Also known as... Bok Bok <laughs> Revolution. <laughs> I think we've... I, th I think... This is the best thing we've found. <laughs> <laughs> yes, right. yes, yes, this yes, actually, yes. This is actually um, a game. All right, big interview. Yeah. Oh, it's it's actually a DDR game. Wait, wait, what? There's no arrows. 
Did, did I put it on a, a, a setting so easy that there's just no arrows to hit? Oh, oh here we go. What? I'm hitting them like exactly. I know this song. I know, what is this? Oh my god, what is this song? Okay, well, I didn't expect to be playing... Bok Bok Revolution? S S Sega Master System D-Pad DDR. You got the best game of the day. That, I mean, that intro was... Wow. Bok Bok Revolution? I'm gonna look this up after we're done playing. Oh my god. Dude, this is ridiculous. I'm actually like in is awe. The, is this the most recent Master System game? I guess 2004? so. 2004. I mean, I'm sure there's some indie games that came out. Yeah, probably. Someone's probably making a cart in their basement right now. Oh my god. Dude, this is hilarious. We gotta, we gotta talk to, uh, gotta talk to Chris Debus, our tournament organizer. He's the, <laughs> he's the DDR champion. He, he knows all of the. Uh, yeah, ask him if he knows Bok Bok Revolution. He, know, he knows all about the, uh, the, the, the best dance pads to buy. I wonder if any of them are compatible with Bok Bok Revolution. You know what's funny? For the Sega Master System. I don't, I don't think this song ends, dude. Well, I am racking up a, a score. Theoretically, my score could go into the uh, millions. Boo, I'm hitting it like at the exact moment that the know, arrow man. is there. I mean, we're also playing on a modern display. I don't know. There might be a little bit of a little bit of input lag. Yeah, it's close to Just a slight. Real DDR experience. Also, I, I love the flickering of the of the arrows. That's really a nice touch. Yeah, it's really good. They really tried hard with this. What is that? Somebody in the comments has to tell us what that song is. Maybe it's from Shenmue. Oh, you know what? That makes a lot of sense. Shenmue 3, but also... That, that's, well, let, let's... Uh, let's see if it's the hey, same also known as. We finished as. the game. We, we did. We played the whole thing. I can add that to my list of completed games. Well, I didn't play it. That's the first time we finished a game. Box birthday. Box birthday. Well, listen, folks. That's box for if you. You're in, if, if it's your birthday and you're in the mood for, for a quality uh, Master System game from the modern era. Box two, birthday. And by that, I mean 2004. Um, give, give Box Birthday a shot. It's just like DDR. Like, almost exactly like it in it's every way. It's completely like DDR. So... Well, folks, that's been another episode of Ever Dives. We, um, oh, man, that, that was, was that was good. <laughs> I have to say that was uh, probably the probably one of our best ones. We played, um, we played, uh, Time Soldiers. Then we played Urban Strike. Then we we tried to play Four and One, the and then Code we got Thirty Eight Volume One was really awesome. Yeah, that was also really good. Uh, and then we played, um, uh, Kyukai Dochiuki. Base, Japanese baseball game, and then we played Box Birthday 2004. So, uh, really good stuff, folks. There you go. Continue to keep watching here in the Long Island Retro Gaming channel, and uh, Brendan, Brendan and I will be back soon with another episode of Everdives. So, we'll see you next time.